He arrived in New Orleans, a 19-year-old from the Danish island of St. Croix, where he had learned from his foster father to help manage his sugarcane plantation with great skill. He was now recommended to his dad's brother in the New World, who was having some health issues and needed help managing his cotton plantation in Louisiana. The young, handsome bachelor was quickly introduced to New Orleans society, and before long, he was courting the most beautiful, sought-after young socialite in the city, Hortense Marjorie. They fell madly in love, and after many months of courtship, Leidesdorf asked her father for his permission to marry Hortense. Hortense was ecstatic with love and joy, and they were engaged to be married in the spring of 1831. William Leidesdorf wrestled for months with the decision to tell the Marginese of his Danish and Negroid roots. He decided that it would not be fair to the woman he loved to withhold that information from her and her family before the marriage, regardless of the consequences. He decided to have a talk with her father, who upon learning about the lightest off lineage, flew into a rage. How could you not tell us that?